Hi, I'm Mesh Dradaire. I am the 2023 recipient of the Department of Energy Office of Nuclear Energy Distinguished ELK Award. My award can be summarized into three components, optimization, control, and integrated theoretical and computational teaching. In the optimization part, we develop efficient multi-objective optimization algorithms to accelerate the reactor design optimization in high fidelity expensive simulations. We leverage neural networks on the fly to reach out to optimal designs in as short time as possible without spending a huge amount of computational cost on running the expensive simulations. In the control part, we develop autonomous control algorithms driven by reinforcement learning and classical control theory. We hybridize data-driven learning with model predictive control to achieve fast, real-time reactivity control in advanced micro-reactor systems. In addition, both our optimization and control algorithms are expected to be open source, application agnostic, and generic, which means you and anybody else can apply it to any reactor design. In the classroom, I'm promoting uh, a new teaching style that combines both theoretical and computational teaching. We uh, apply a lot of nuclear codes and computational skills to analyze reactor systems, and students seem to love that so far. I want to work in small modular reactors, so being able to run them and figure out what optimal designs and setups are is great. By teaching people to be able to run these simulations, we can increase the speed at which we determine which designs are best and increase the speed at which we can determine that these designs are safe, which will speed up the rate at which we can bring advanced reactor designs into this country. I encourage all new engineering faculty around the country to include more computational tools in their course. Yes, you expect to do more additional work compared to a traditional course. However, the impact of these computational tools on your career and on the students' skills will be incredible.